guys, kumusta kayo lahat? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Ako ulit ako si your Pinoy trucker in USA. Anyway, as you can see, I'm in the car right now. I'm actually here at the parking lot here at Best Buy. Guys, I was about to get something here, pero guys, it's close due to COVID-19. Lahat ng Best Buy dito is you cannot go in. They're open, but you cannot go in. You can only order online and then you can pick it up over here at the store so you order online pick it up but you can go in all this by for two weeks dahil nga sa, ano, sa coronavirus um bibili kasi sana ako dito ng charger for my speaker kasi nasira and unfortunately it's close so what i'm gonna do next um is I'm gonna go to Seafood City. It is a Filipino market. I'm gonna go buy something. Um, like, I wanna buy some groceries, guys. Like meat and mga dilata. And I actually, I'm really, really craving for spaghetti. So I think I'm gonna buy the noodles and the the sauce and the all the ingredi uh, ingredients para lutuin natin. And that's gonna be for my dinner. I'm really craving for that. So we're in Chicago. I'm back here again. So I'm just here for 10 hours break. Um, what else? After ko mag uh, seafood city, I'm gonna go again to Walmart. I'm gonna buy something there too. Um, actually, uh, I'm gonna get a. Uh, I'm gonna get more bottle of waters para my extra audit ako kasi. But uh, may marami akong tubig sa truck ko, but I wanted to buy more extra just in case. Alam mo yun, you just gotta be prepared at least one ano lang, one or two. Kasi pupunta ko ng Florida and my sister told me na medyo kulang sila sa tubig dun. So I'm gonna buy I'm gonna buy two, one for me and one for her. So and then kailang kung ano bang bibilhin ko. Basta, we'll go check it out later. We'll see what's gonna happen there once we get there at Walmart. But first, I'm gonna go to Jollibee or Seafood City. Malapit lang dito. It is 11 miles away from here. So yeah, see ya. North Avenue. It is crazy. Ah, it is so sad, guys. Yung coronavirus na to. Um, you know how many how many person who got affected sa coronavirus dito sa states is nasa ano na um, I think they get tested for uh, positive mga nasa 36,000 na and then yung deaths is nasa ano na nasa almost 500 people imagine that that is really that is really sad, ano? Kasi nag-spread out na talaga all over the world. It, it started from just one until nag-explode. Nakakatakot. Even me, myself, especially we are truck drivers. We are always traveling all over the US. I'm an over the road truck driver. So, kahit ako sa sarili ko, uh, as in natatakot na rin ako. You know? So, what I did, whenever... So, yeah, yun nga guys, kahit ako sa sarili ko, natatakot na rin ako mag, uh, mag-drive. Nandun yung fear kasi most of the time we are on the road and we are more exposed sa, ano, ano, sa public. Kasi we have to drop the load, we have to keep running, and and for, for your living. Kasi kung hindi ka magtatrabaho, how are you gonna pay your bills? And at the same time, it is also my concern na uh, if, if all the truck drivers are Continue gonna... Continue on Illinois 171 North for five miles. If all, if all truck drivers gonna stop working, what's gonna happen here? You know, paano, paano magkaroon ng groceries yung mga market? Then, like mga clothing or your medical supplies, are you guys gonna have that if we don't have truck drivers running? You know, uh, in lang, um, ako, I'm really proud as a truck driver and um, I love my job, and I am also happy that I, I am able, I am one of the 
person that able to get America moving. Um, I'm proud to say that it's a lot of truck drivers. So, ayun, uh, I hope na pasalamatan din natin yung mga ibang truck drivers dyan kasi um, yun nga, uh, we are the backbone of uh, the country kasi kung wala kami, walang mga supplies, yung store, yung market anything that we have right now these days is, it's, it's because kami mga drivers, we keep it moving about it it's just that in general that we have to thank them dahil nga kung mag stop kami wala wala tayong mga pagkain niya anyway sorry I've been kasi the whole day you're driving for a couple hours so parang alam mo yun yung masakit din sa likod sa paa so you need to do something like move or walking but ngayon hindi ko muna ginagawa yan kasi dahil nga sa coronavirus uh, social distancing and as much as possible self-quarantine talaga I mean there are still um, yung ibang market marami pa namang open dito like mga store even coffee shop open pa naman yun nga lang hindi ka na maka, wala nang dine in and then yung mga market din dito open pa naman but it's your choice to go out it's up to you but we should follow the advice of the government or in public uh, what is it how would I say it yung public reminder na we should do a self quarantine stay home and then iwas muna yung mga crowded areas kasi para ma-avoid yung coronavirus kasi what happened is the reason why it is growing up or it is going so fast yung spread ng virus is because people don't listen at yun yung problema eh so we should we should have a cooperation kung gusto nating umalis yung sakit na to or mag go away then we should have to follow the rules we should have uh Garun dapat tayo ng consideration. Anyway, I talk too much, I think. So, see you guys na lang mamaya. Doon sa seafood market. Doon sa Jollibee. Sa seafood city. And then, Walmart. See you guys. I know I'm trying to remind you guys na self-quarantine and stay home as you could, as possible. Um, but ako, as you can see, I'm here outside right now. I'm not even staying home. Well, it's because I'm a truck driver. Plus, um, um, it is also even anywhere you go, it is a risk. But my point is, don't go to a to a place where it's so crowded, like let's say the airport or mga places like coffee shop or bars, which is so 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 crowded. You know, mga places na anything anything na super crowded yun ang iwasan natin. But like me, I know I know I'm here outside. I'm driving. I'm in public but the thing is do I have a choice I don't right but I have to go to the store to buy something and so it is a risk actually it is a risk I know I should have stayed home but wala akong bahay I live in the truck and I gotta buy food I gotta buy extra food for myself so yeah but then again ang um, pinaka public advice is yun nga um, if you have enough food in your in your at home then just stay home huwag nang tayong lumabas para maiwasan yung coronavirus I mean it is for our own safety din naman so yun lang guys so I do apologize kung sinasabi ko sa inyo na stay home but me myself even myself hindi naman ako nasa bahay ngayon kasi nga sabi ko nga um, I have to go to the store to buy something food and then I'm a truck driver 
So, yun lang ang advice na dapat natin i-follow. On the way na tayo papunta ng Seafood City, kaya lang traffic kasi may train na dumaan dun. And kanina pa yan, mga ano na, mga 15 minutes ago na. Hindi pa rin naka... Hindi pa. And then, umandar pa rin yung train. So, I guess... It is what it is. I just gotta wait. So... Meron pa naman mga tao naglalakad. Si dito sa side na to, naka-stop din dahil traffic. Yun lang ang pangit sa Chicago guys. Always traffic. Parang Pilipinas din. We're still nine miles away, 19 minutes drive to Seafood City. What a god! Oh, come on! Ito pa rin, nagaantay pa rin. Ang tagal naman ng train na yan. Alam nyo guys, gutom na gutom na ako. I didn't eat the whole day. Ang kinain ko lang kanina banana. So, kailangan ko lang kumain. Soon, I can wait na makabalik ulit sa truck. Kasi, dun ko lulutuin guys yung, yung food sa truck ko. I'm gonna, I'm, that's why I'm, I'm going to Walmart to buy something like a big, uh, yung lutuan ng spaghetti. Siguro may mga items sila dun na close to $25 siguro mga $20 bucks. and yun ang gagamitin kong pang loto we'll see take the back streets kasi mas ano mas mas madali kasi hindi pa rin natapos yung traffic doon i think may discuss siya kaya nag u-turn na lang ako at and i take the back streets back streets para makarating na ako dito kasi gutom na gutom na Here, pasok na tayo. May jacket lang tayo dahil malamig. Malamig sa labas. Ang ano ko dun ha? So, nandito na tayo sa Seafood City. Ito yung Seafood City Market guys. Uh, it's owned by Filipino. So, every states dito sa Amerika, may tinatawag sila na seafood city it's like pretty much like walmart or target oh i need a card 
I need a cart para sa kailangan kong bumili ng isang pound gagawin kong sinigang guys six dollars I think meron din silang tilapia it's only eight dollars guys parang ang sarap nito ah um dollars and 22 Yung ina. Yung ina. Sa ina. Bato na muna Sana itong bilhin yung Argentina corn beef. Pero guys, alam mo kung magkano? Almost six dollars. Six dollars plus tax is seven dollars. Ganito lang kaliit ito. Ayan o. Hindi ko siya bibilhin. Parang ang mahal. Gusto ko sana bumili ng tatlo, apat. Kung sa, yung sa Walmart, mas mura sila eh. Dito mahal. So, hindi ko siya kukunin. Uh, I think that's it. Ito yung panghala sa spaghetti sauce. So we need one of this and then one of this. Filipino style. Okay. The spaghetti.
pinamili ko guys Are you guys still open? Yep. Yeah. Um, can I get one bucket, bro? Spicy. Okay. One bucket spicy? Yeah. Would you like the six piece or the ten piece, bro? Oh, you have the ten piece now? Mm -hmm. Oh, I just need the six. Okay. Anything else? That's it. So, we're in the jolly <laughs> Um, I'm going to get one bucket. Because I'm going to I can't wait to eat. So, bawal yung tayo ngayon. It's close. Let's see. It's close. So, three person at a time. Pag lima kayo, bawal. So, so hindi naman yung busy ngayon. Alright guys, kaya na lang natin ito. Um, lagay na natin dito. So, napamahal nga yun yung bili natin. I, I didn't expect na I'll be spending almost $200 for all of this. Pero, again, it's worth it naman eh. Kasi it's good for, it's good for a month. So, mahal lang siya uh, one time. Pero, worth it naman tatagal naman ng isang buwan or so so ayun punta pa ako ng Walmart and then oh. alright it's done then may Jollibee pa ako punta okay. dito so guys may seafood city tayo dito sa Chicago if ever na mapunta kayo dito sa Chicago, we have a Jollibee and we have a seafood market, seafood city market. So, maganda, di, maganda yung location. Bibili sana ako ng tinapay, kaya lang, sarado na. So, balik na tayo. Punta na tayo sa Walmart. Ah! Uh.